It's been a week of comings and goings at the Kingston Centre, with Monday being no exception. There's been a great deal of gravel delivered. And of course it all needs levelled and compacted. The start of the week saw the third foundation line, on the west, begun. Form building for the concrete pours is a major task for the carpenters on site, and it demands precision and skill. Behind the foundation line, work on removing spoil can be seen. On Monday, there were several different trucks involved. And a busy operator. Considerable care is taken to remove groundwater that could be contaminated. And there was one such removal on Monday. Tuesday began with the West Foundation line already considerably extended. And there's always more work for the roller compactors. Very little though interrupts the delivery of gravel. With many forms already in place and awaiting concrete, it was time for the concrete pumper literally to swing into action. It didn't take very long at all for the first concrete to flow. It's always a team game, with finishing, vibration and control of the flow all playing a part. Nearby on site, removal of groundwater continued to be a consistent theme. Other commitments drew me away from the site for much of Wednesday, but I know that a certain amount of work was performed in the northwest corner. The foundation line was cleaned up, ready for the installation of wall forms, and of course, there was a considerable amount of gravel delivered. The compacted base for the new store continues to grow. On the south foundation line beside Bath Road, wall forms are coming off and the reinforcing rod for pillars is placed. Preparation of the west foundation line forms has reached the corner and wall forms are being placed on the section poured earlier in the week. Almost inevitably, 
the gravel just keeps coming. Friday saw the concrete bumper back on station, servicing the West Foundation line. Once concrete starts to flow, there is no break for the crew concerned. The pour on Friday set the site up well for continued work in the week ahead. It will come as no surprise to learn that gravel just kept coming. I think we'll see a great deal more in the weeks ahead. Of course, for every arrival, there is a departure. And we'll close this week's update with the departure of the concrete pumper. She'll be back good and early next week. I hope you will too. Thanks for watching.